Hi there guys, welcome back. Okay, this is video and part two of the branding cell for making a banner that we're going to place inside of the ads team. Now in video one you saw me create the purple background banner, 7 to 8 by 90, as you can see it's here. What you're looking at here, you're looking at tinypick.com, tinypick.com, that's T-I-N-Y-P-I-C.com. Um, it's basically a free hosting site, a free image hosting site, which is all you need, completely free to use, completely free to register. Um, there's a few out there, there's like Photo Bucket, which I did used to use myself, but I did have a few problems with it, with images not being displayed correctly, so I've gone to another good one that's got a reputation, it's tinypick.com. And all you need, create a free account, and it's very, very straightforward, just click the upload, find your saved image file, and upload it, and then it will display here. And then all you just need then is your direct link for it, which so you right click there and copy that there. You go into the ads team and depending on where you wanted to place it. Now I've gone in to say that I'm going to be choosing a paper click and I've already got it half ready for you. So I've just clicked the 20 paper click banner credits, the size 72890, going to get 20 clicks. I've just copied that title because it has no relevance on the banner. More ads team signups and the banner URL is the one that we just took from there. Okay, I'll right click and copy that there. And then come into here, paste that in there, and it, as soon as you click outside of that, and when it's done, it should immediately display your banner. And as you can see, it's nice and effective, nice and catching. Display start date, you've got the 22nd or whatever, daily clicks limit. So you could, if you wanted to have all the clicks on one day, they'll display it until you've got the clicks. If you said I only want 10 clicks a day, um, it's entirely up to yourself, obviously, yeah, so... You can hover over here, specify the maximum possible clicks per day for the banner. Now I was going to put, say, 10 a day. doesn't really matter. And I say, what I've gone for, I've just gone for the 20 clicks for $5. Okay, because I say to people, just don't go for the highest package straight away. Test a few banners out, see which gets the clicks better and longer and things like that. You'll be able to tell by the amount of time that it's running and what sort of clicks it does get. You're going to need a destination URL, so I'm going to send it to the, the Perseverance Network. Just uh, I'm to lean over again. Let me just type that out for you quickly. Okay, so you type in whichever way you wanted to send it to. Um, obviously, if you've got an advert like this, you want to be making sure you send them to some sort of system that is going to encourage them to get more ads team signups. Now I can do that with the Perseverance Network because the ads team is the lead program or one of the main programs in the funnel system should I say. So they can see that by promoting that system they will generate more ads team signups. So if you've got any sort of marketing system where you could just do an offer for yourself and um, sort of think it through. Display and start date. Uh, daily clicks limit all countries or selected countries. You can see if you change the selected countries, it does go up to eight dollars. Um, I often do use it because it's nice to concentrate on the top tier. But some people say they like all countries. Now, there's no sort of rhyme or reason to which is better. Again, test it yourself. You know, you may go for the all countries, and you might get a lot of country uh, country signups but they may not become active we may focus on the say top tier countries you may get less sort of signups but they could produce to be more active and the only way is literally to do I would say do two identical ads and do one for all countries and one for selected top tier or something like that it's the only real way you get you're gonna sort of gauge the difference that you get so that's entirely up to yourself which way you want to do it so I'm going to put it back to all countries and then what I'll do, I'll do a second one and I'll do the top tier ones and we'll see the difference, okay? And I can do it in the earning balance, the coin payments, agree the terms and conditions and that's it. Then you can purchase it, okay? Go ahead and purchase it and then out away you go. And it really is as simple as that, okay? So we're going to purchase that one. We will test the banner first of all, make sure it's okay. We will test the word in. Okay, for enter validator invalid banner size. So okay, so it's going to go and check this. I 
I don't know why it's coming up with that. But that's basically how you do it. I'll also go back over this and check it yourself. Um, because it is 728 by 90, it is total clicks. Um, everything is right. So what I'll do anyway, that is how you do that is how you do it. Um, these, these little glitches uh, do come up. So I'll go back through and check this myself and just find out why it's not displaying correctly. But that's that's basically the process that you would need from creating your banner, get it hosted, and then away we go. So thanks for watching. And I'll catch you on the next video. Cheers.